Brain Tech here, where tech is made simple. Last week, Microsoft rolled out Windows 11 build 25272, which is the latest dev channel build for the Windows 11 insiders. And uh, one of the features they did remove and deprecate uh, in build 25272, which I did post on, and I'll leave a link to that video if that would be of interest. And one of the features they did remove was showing recommended common websites um, on the recommended section in the start which Microsoft was testing uh, in the dev channel and uh, due to uh, user feedback removed those website recommendations from the recommended section in the start menu. Now um, on that note, uh, currently in the stable version of Windows 11, if we just head over to the file explorer and we head over to the folder options for the file explorer. Uh, currently when it comes to privacy, we only have three settings and options available show recently used files show frequently used folders show files from office.com now if we head out of that and um, if we just head over to a screenshot uh, that was posted by Zeno over on twitter and uh, Zeno is a windows enthusiast um, who did a bit of digging and in this screenshot we can see that in the privacy section and i do apologize if the quality of the screenshot looks a little bit grainy um, over and above the first three options, as mentioned, we get show recommended content now, which seems to be a um, option and a setting that Microsoft could be testing internally and uh, could be working on internally. So although they have removed the recommended websites from the recommended section uh, in the start menu, uh, it seems like they may be wanting to push some other so-called advertising or recommendations in the file explorer in the future. But according to this screenshot and the post by Zeno over on Twitter, they are giving you the option to toggle show recommended content on or off, which I think is a nice move if they do ever roll this out. And at this stage, though, it's very hard to tell what exactly that actual recommended content will be because it's very early days. But nonetheless, just to keep you in the loop and up to speed, so to speak, just wanted to let you know about that new option, show recommended content which um, Microsoft could be testing internally and may be on its way to a dev channel uh, build in the Windows 11 Insider program shortly. But obviously, if anything does um, change, I will obviously post and let you know. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.